video is going to be about external editors uh, for Bootstrap Studio. This will make Bootstrap Studio a, a very powerful tool from this and this is how you do it. So you just pick um, any of these things for example and if you, if you have your site just use that as well. So here we have this, uh, this thing here. So what you do is for example here's the nav bar on the left and if you just go convert to HTML and we will find custom code here and if you go here <coughs> and here you see things and then you go to edit code and this is the the part that we're going to edit we're not going to do very much because it's the demonstration that's the important part in here so you have this the nav class nav bar etc so and right click on the custom code and open in um you configure editors here your default editor is probably uh, is a text made for mac and notepad for windows anyway you can add these if you just click this one down on the right hand side here add editor i choose brackets and um so anyway we're gonna do this and this syncs everything so go to brackets and now you'll see the nav code in this editor i've chosen brackets because even though i use different one brackets is a good one it's free it's customizable and it's it has lots of uh, things great things like emmet and you can actually see php uh, in the uh, the um if you put a, a server on as well so just wait a lot loads and um yeah so for anybody that wants to know how to use this it, it is quite an easy one to learn and it's taking a little bit to load here but yeah so i hope um you know you actually enjoy this type of thing because it is a much more powerful way to go about things so now you have on here you've got the nav exactly like this here so for example we're just going to change um it's got their home so we just put something called about and here it's got projects and we're just going to put uh i don't know <laughs> contact for example contact and we'll save this and if you watch when you save this these here will change in bootstrap studio so you just go file save and there you go so i don't know if you actually saw that but now that changed to about and contact where before it was home and products so that's really all you do uh that's uh, it's a fantastic tool that um and it will show up on here as well so if you go into if you see this just click down when it's ready it's not but there it is so now you have about contact where as i said you have home and products so that's basically all you do so yeah so it's a it's a fantastic tool that they've uh they put in there um if i if anybody's interested in this and a bit confused by that um i can show them what to do because it's a it makes bootstrap studio along with a an editor an outside editor very very powerful and um really i think uh, apart from images it's it's as good as it can be with um for now anyway because the, if you have emma the, you know you've got really fast code there um and i would uh you know I'll, i've mentioned emma many times before in the videos but yeah custom code is definitely the way to go um drag and drop it's if you really want to learn how to be a web, web developer you do need a code um so thanks for watching this video